Hey guys, it's Beef, back with some more FTB. Did a little, a little changes, I did a little changes. Made a few changes to the kitchen, I replaced the wool panels with the birch panels. Apparently you can cut the birch, um, the birch, uh, jeez, what are they called? Planks? <laughs> into smaller pieces. I had tried before and it didn't work, but that was before the patch, so maybe the patch fixed it? I have no idea. Anyway, yeah, so we've got birch instead of the wool. I think it looks a lot better. It looks a lot more like a kitchen. Um, I replaced these back strips with a, or iron. They look better. They match the, the furnaces better. I now have a dishwasher, which is covered up conveniently by a cutting board. That's, that's my cutting board. This actually looks like an, a stove top. If I had like four of these, it would look pretty damn good. I mean, darned, pretty darned good. But I sort of want to make the furnaces the f furnace or the ovens. So we're going to keep it like this. And this is going to be a dishwasher, but it's really a compressor, which I've used a bunch of times already. I turned the fridge into a couple macerators. They look really good. Eventually, I want to make these the rotary macerators. I even have a little handle. I think I added the handle um, in the episode. So yeah, that's pretty much what I did. As for wiring, pretty simple. Uh, everything's wired, everything works. Uh, this wall might have to be pushed out one in this section because uh, of the of powering the top. Oh, I still have a little wood panel here. Of powering the top uh, macerator, but no big deal. Did I put anything in here? No. Electric engine. I don't think I've done anything else. Oh. We have a quarry ready to go, ready to dig out quite a large spot. And I'm having second thoughts about the water mills because a very cool guy named, oh crap, what was his name? Hold on. Let me go open that window. <laughs> Raker Zero, or it could be Raker O. I think it's Raker Zero. Uh, he mentioned that because I wanted to try stuff with Blutricity. I wanted to use Blutricity to make stuff because it looks interesting, but I didn't realize you could convert it into other um, power sources like MJ and EU instead of Blutricity. But you can. Raker gave me a great tip. Basically, the key to everything is a Blutricity engine. Um, so I've been working towards that here. I have a bunch of stuff in my inventory trying to get this Blutricity engine going. What happens is, let me show you real quick what I have already. You have these uh, Blutricity solar panels. I only have 12 right now. By my estimates, I think I need probably 40 to have a nice steady flow of Blutricity. Although this is full now, this battery box. It just takes longer to fill up. So you have these solar panels, which, let me show you how they're made. They're pretty cheap to make, solar panels. It's these here. Uh, so you need blue alloy ingot, which is basically silver and four nickelite. Um, I have tons of silver and tons of nickelite. And then you need eight blue doped wafers per uh, per panel. And that's basically one silicone wafer and four nickelite. For, for the silicone wafer, you create it by cutting a silicone b bowl? Boola? Booya? Booya? I don't know. <laughs> you create it by cutting one of these. And uh, you create one of these just simply by sanding and coal. So that's pretty cheap. Um, this bad boy, the bat box, is not that expensive either. Let me show you that. Battery box. I did all this off camera, but I made a eh, It's okay. Uh, basically, iron, blue alloy ingot, plank, and uh, a battery. Four batteries, actually. BT battery. And all you need is, again, nickelite, copper, tin, copper. Easy to create. We've got everything set up here. And now, what we're going to do, down here, I have, I should probably make a quick way down. Oh, there we go. That's a, well, no, I won't be able to get up through there. Okay, there we go. We're good. So down here, I have my quarry. I'm going to dig out all this stuff. I have a lot of resources under my base. I first started mining, like branch mining the first layer here just to get some copper because I'm all out of copper. I didn't even do this layer actually, or this row. Uh, and I branch mined a couple of layers down below for the diamond. Everything in between is unexplored. So I have a quarry here and I've set the quarry up to mine about, well you can see, 
from here to where the water mills start and to the end of my plot. So it's a pretty large area. And we're going to power this uh, this quarry using Blutricity. Sort of. Well, not sort of. We are. That, that's what's going to happen. Um, oh, wait a minute. You know what? Let me just do this. So these things, these bad boys here, they're really cool. Um, so we're going to have our Blutricity engine here to power our quarry. The engine goes here. So that means... This goes there. These things, you can you can place them like al along the wall and stuff. I love that. Oh wait, where's the entrance up? I think it's over here. Yes. So where are we in? Okay, okay. So let's do this. Okay, so this bad boy is gonna power our engine. It's nighttime now, so it's not collecting any. I wonder why it's going down. Is it just because it's is it loading up the circuit with power or something? That'd be pretty cool. Alright, so. Um, <clears throat> oh, by the way, to create, like, to create, like, the, um, this stuff, you need, to, you need the alloy furnace, and that's why I have two of those there. And all you do for that is, uh, just some bricks in the shape of the way you'd create a regular furnace. Oh, and I have some more ready. Nice. Uh, wait a minute. It's silicone wafers... And these. Oh, I'm running out of Nicolite. This is unbelievable. <laughs> Another reason to build this quarry. I believe it's one wafer per four Nicolite to create one of these. Uh, wait, can you... Yeah, one per four. Okay, so this will create another stack. That's good. Do I have anything in here? No. I have a ton of uh, blue alloy ingots already, so that's good. We could create some more sol solar panels. Now, the final placement for these solar panels is probably not going to be here. Oh, I have more in here, Nicolite. And, oh, and more, more cable, too. Good. Yeah, I'm just thinking. Oh, I also created a, uh, a rock cutter, which acts like silk touch, and a lap pack, which means I can use my rock cutter, and it'll charge it automatically from my lap pack if I wear it. And I need new armor. That armor is looking <laughs> pretty beat up. Actually, I saw a recipe. Let's do that real quick while uh, while I remember. Where's the gold ingots? Let's do this. I'm not sure if this is any good at all. I couldn't find any information on it on the FTB wiki. Um, but I hope this works. Exochassis. It does work. Okay. I don't know if it's any good, like I said. It might be the big waste of time. So that's what? How many do I have there? What number is that? S eight. Okay, eight. So we can create a chess piece. Exo chess plate. Is this any good, guys? Or is it basically just... Oh. What? Whoa, that looks awesome. Is that supposed to be the texture, or is the texture broken? It looks really cool. Oh man, that is... okay. <laughs> Alright. Um, I sort of want to create more of those. I want to do a full body suit, body armor for that. I got tons of iron, so I think I can afford it. Um, yeah. Oh man. Okay. Ah, let's 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 do that real quick. Sweet, I'm all exoed out. Oh, okay. That's got to be like a broken texture or something, right? I don't know. Like the helmet looks so derpy. What is going on here? Does this even work? Oh, okay. We gotta test it. Well, there's no. There are no mobs right now. We gotta remember. Nighttime. We gotta test it. Anyway, back to what we were doing. What was I doing? We got more of these. Oh, yeah, we were gonna create some more <clears throat> solar panels. Excuse me for that. Uh, let's create some more solar panels. It's really, the solar panels are not that expensive. If you have a lot of that blue stuff, that's eight more solar panels. Oh, yeah. That puts me up to 20 total. Uh, as I was mentioning before, I don't think this is going to be the final setup for them. In fact, I know it isn't. They're not just going to sit here on dirt 
Uh, I gotta I gotta relocate them to a convenient spot. Look, everybody's having fun with the red power stuff. This is the gym's place. He's got some frames going on. He's got baseboard. Very cool. Love that mod. And we'll get back to playing around with that again in the near future. But for now, we got to work out our power situation. <laughs> this armor, I don't know if that's broken or not. I might have just created something broken. Maybe it's supposed to look like that. Oh, crap. We're one short there. That's okay. Uh, I don't know if this is supposed to be, like, connected and stuff. It probably is. So let's do that. Yeah, our battery box is fully charged. Let's not worry about solar panels right now. What we need to do... A geothermal generator... Oh, I also created a magma crucible, because that's... Okay, let me, let me try to run through everything. Solar panels power the battery box. Battery box powers a blue electric engine, which I don't have yet. The blue electric engine powers the magma crucible, which turns nether rack and cobble into lava, which in turn flows through to the geothermal generator, and you can use the geothermal generator to power just about anything. Uh, well, the, the important machines that I've been using. So yeah, um, I'm considering this over the water mills. Maybe I'll have both. Maybe I'll donate the water mills to the, to the town place. <laughs> the town place. Okay. I think we're ready for our blue electric engine. Um, it's it's not it's not a easy thing to create. We need diamonds. Ooh, I don't even have. Wait, didn't I pick up diamonds somewhere? Diamond ore somewhere? No. Hmm. Give me a second. I'll be right back. All right, I got the extra diamond I needed. Don't ask where. I had to steal it. No, I'm just kidding. I had it in one of these chests somewhere. I can't even remember. Everything is a huge mess. But we do have the chest um, organization thing now, which is nice. That has recently been added right after I added it manually. I think it was added as a regular thing. Part of the mod pack, I should say. I probably have a bunch of stuff somewhere that I don't even know, like good stuff. Look at look at all this bauxite, bauxite, I think it's pronounced. Dust. Oh, I have three brass ingots in here and Okay. Oh, we're going to need these. Okay, let's just, okay, let's leave it. Leave it. I still have this armor. Oh, and it's nighttime. I want to check out see if this protects me well or not. Let's do that quick before we get to making this. Well, I guess we could make it right now while while the sun officially goes down. So we gotta make one of the oh wait a minute, I don't even know if you can you no, know, you can't do that. You gotta use a compressor. It's the same uh, thing I'm using to compress my iron into iron blocks. There we go. Nine diamond into the compressor. Get you a diamond block. Okay. Now let's go find some sort of mob. We'll take some damage, we'll see. Oh, I can't wait to see what everybody builds with these um these blocks with red power, the red power saws. Okay. Oh, hey, you. You usually take a lot of... You usually do a lot of... Holy crap! He still did a lot of damage. I don't think this stuff does anything. Holy crap. Took half my health. And it's not even taking... Damage. I'm guessing it's used for something else. Can I push you and... No. It doesn't really show you. Exo, exo boots. What's the use for them? There's nothing. It's probably something that isn't in the game yet, and I just wasted a ton of iron. Well, it's not like I didn't have much to to spare. <laughs> I had a ton of iron to spare. Okay, let's um. Yeah. Oh, and I didn't even notice that it doesn't even have the the armor rating up top either. So I'm sure I'm doing something terribly wrong with this armor. Let's put it away, and let's get our other armor, which I put here. It's almost dead, but better safe than sorry. Got it. So I need to create one of these, and for those I need six iron, which I have, one blue alloy ingot, which I have, two of these, which I don't. Uh, each one of these requires all of this. I can create these, I don't have these. Copper, I have. Diamond drop plate, I do not have. A diamond drop plate is created by an iron panel strip, four of them around diamond panel, and a diamond panel is cut up 
um, into... Oh, wait a minute. I don't even know if I'm going to have enough diamond. Because if this is... I need how many of these? Two. No. Four. Eight. I need eight of them. And each one is a diamond panel. Ooh. Ooh. Let's see what happens when you cut it. That's a diamond slab. That's a diamond panel. That gives me four. And I can't cut these any further because then it's diamond cover and you can't use diamond cover. It's got to be diamond panel. Holy crap. Okay, these. Let's cut two of those. Let's cut two of those. Let's just double check. I know the saw's on the ground. Let's double check what we need. Iron panel strip. Okay, so... This is iron panel, so if you cut this iron panel strip. Alright, so one of these... Oh, okay, you get two diamonds back, so if even if I screwed up, I get my diamonds back. Now I probably won't. A diamond drop plate, that's one. Yikes. That's two. Ugh. I'm feeling sick to my stomach, wasting all my diamond. Wait, did I do that right? Is that panel? Yes, that's right. Okay. So let's just grab a bunch of these. Oh my gosh. Oh man, I only have enough to make two more. Alright. That's not going to be enough. Because you need one to make one of these. Find copper wire. Where's my copper? Let's let's just do that. Let's build as many as we can, and then we'll go out caving looking for more. Oh, oh! I didn't need to create. Oh, I did not know this. Look at this. Seven, eight. Holy crap! Okay. See, I wish they warned you about that. I just wasted a ton of diamond, didn't I? Sure did. I guess eventually I might need these eight. Eight of these bad boys I just created. Holy crap, you got to be kidding me. Can I undo this here? No. I probably need to put it in some sort of decompressor or something. Holy... It's okay. All part of the learning process. Man, what a waste. <laughs> Alright. I have some of these in here, don't I? Two. Okay, let's create some of these. 16. It's probably more than enough. What are we trying to make again? This thing. Copper coil. We need four and four. So we need eight total. I think that's what I have. Yeah. Can I, uh... Can I do this? Yes, I can. Wait, is that iron? I think that's iron. I hope that's iron. Well, might as well create both of them now. We need two. Oh, wow, I had no idea that was... You can use it more than once. Okay, so now we have our carpet coil. We're good. We're, we're, we're in good shape now. So I need six ingots, one blue alloy ingot. Do I have... I do, and I have six ingots on me. Blue alloy ingot. We have... Oh. We have this, boom, electric motor. And now, we get these, the brass ingots and the brass gears. We got the, the blue electric motor. We have the glass, and we have the brass. <laughs> and it rhymes, now we have a blue electric engine, yes! Oh, all the endless power that I will get from this simply by melting nether rack into nothing into lava okay there better not be like a creeper that blows this stuff up i will be very upset okay we gotta po power this um now it probably isn't gonna do very well right off the bat because it's nighttime and i don't have very many oh yes it's working i think i don't have very many uh 
solar panels, so the chances are that it probably isn't going to do much. Well, but there's a laser. The laser's doing something. Okay. Laser's doing... And the, and the sun is coming up. Yeah, the sun's going to come up soon. The battery. This is the reserve power. It's already feeding the engine. I'm very excited about this new form of electricity. I have just discovered. I haven't discovered it. Thanks, uh, Riker Zero. Very good tip. I'm still not sure if these are more effective than regular solar panels, to be quite honest. Um, one per every four. It's not going to be enough. But uh, it's something different, and I don't want to always be... I don't want everybody to be doing the same thing. It gives you a reason to watch everybody's perspectives. So uh, now you know that I am... I'm using Blutricity, at least temporarily. Once... By the way, once the quarry's done... Oh! Oh, I need to pipe... I need to pipe stuff. <laughs> pipe. Let's go with some cobble pipe. Cobblestone waterproof? No, just cobblestone. It's just cobble and glass. Got it. I have glass on me? No. I have glass in here. Yes. Do I need more than eight? I don't think I do. Uh, cobble. And glass. Got it. And now, where are my... Where are my... Um, chests that I create? There they are. Don't know if this is going to be enough chests either. Okay, so there goes the Blutricity powering my engine, which is power. Oh, that was a long drop. Powering the quarry, which is slowly breaking blocks, I assume. Now let's get this bad boy up through here. Uh, we'll do this. We'll power. Yeah, we'll, we'll not power. We'll, uh, we'll have the chests here. And there. In fact, let's break that so we can actually open the chests later. This pipe is intruding in my area. Actually, no, it's not. I shouldn't say that. Okay. So, this thing is spinning like crazy. It's got to clear out a lot of stuff here. So, this is probably going to be a while before it actually starts picking things up. I don't see the laser, though. I hope it's working. Should be working. Oh, there it is. Laser's doing stuff. Let's go over there. <laughs> Get lasered. It is doing things. Okay. Ooh, now we're going to get lasered. Right in the eyes. I think I'm blind. Okay. I'm happy about this. I want some more solar panels. And I think I might need more chests here. Pretty sure. Oh. Oh, no, that was me that broke that. I thought the laser was already breaking stuff up there. Let's go take a look. Oh, yeah, it's breaking stuff up here now. We're not going to be able to use this exit anymore. Because every time I place a block, it's going to break it. So, yeah, let's uh, let's use the exit over this away. Where the water mills are. I might still use water mills. I don't know. I like different stuff. No, I don't think anybody's using water mills that I know of. And um, and I don't think anybody's using Blutricity. I know uh, B00 wanted to use Blutricity, but then he like ran into some problem or something. And he didn't end up using it. But yeah, I'm happy about this. We need more solar panels, though. Let's go cook some more of these up. in our alloy furnace. I believe it's four. I don't think, I think I'm gonna have to use up all my resources, all my nickelite resources to make these. So 64, 64, you need eight of them. So that's only gonna make uh, eight of them. <laughs> you need eight of them per, oh wait, no, like this, yeah. Okay, so that's another eight. That's not bad. Place these bad boys. So what I think I'm going to do now is um, maybe let 
the quarry do its thing. It might, it might be a while before the quarry actually finishes doing what it needs to do. Because I wanted to show you how I'm going to make the Blutricity into, uh, or, um, what's it called? How I'm going to convert it, is the word I was looking for, into EU. Because that is the most interesting part, in my opinion. And put one more here. That's more electricity. I should get some more bat boxes going too so that I can store energy during the night. Hmm, I might do that. Dang it, I can't believe you can use the drop plate more than once. I made so much. I made four drop plates. I don't think I can turn them back into... Can turn into fine iron wire, fine copper wire. I'm sure they'll come in handy eventually. Uh, but yeah, I guess I will, um, we should do some mining, actually. Now that we're running low on diamond, our, our copper isn't great. Well, we do have a bit. Our tin, our silver. Oh, we need silver now, too, to make this stuff, to make the, the solar panels. So, let me get some tools ready. Um, oh, and maybe get some new armor or something. Maybe we'll go all... All fancy and use sapphire, something crazy like that. Maybe some green sapphire <laughs> to make our armor, and uh, we'll go find a place to mine because yeah, we need we need some resources. I'll be right back. All right, we are. I didn't make. I just made regular iron armor. So let's do a quick bit of caving before we call it an episode. That works. Okay, good. <laughs> I brought a bronze pick with me, along with my diamond. Ooh, there's a lot here. So our main objective is finding copper like this. Beautiful. Uh, this stuff we're going to leave behind. Uh, this we're going to get. It's either tin or, or... Yep, it's tin. Tin or silver. They look very similar. We need both. So we're going to grab the tin. Fantastic. And it's, uh, if you can't tell, it's thundering out. Our silk touch rock cutter it cuts rock beautifully. It doesn't have very many uses though. And look, I've used it like eight, nine times, including the little test I did, and uh, it's wasted 4,000 EU. I might have tested it more than once though. Okay, let's let's get going. I'm grabbing all the important stuff, or the stuff that's immediately important to us. Don't do it, you bastard. Oh, yes, more please. This copper is gonna come in so handy. Oh, there's a lot of there's a lot here. <laughs> Meanwhile, my quarry is doing its job, so it's double the mining duty. What do we have here? Nine. That is good. Yeah, so this. I don't think you can make armor out of um the the jewels. Like the ruby and the sapphire. I think you can make tools, but not armor. Uh, I changed my mind about it anyways, because, yeah, I don't think I can make it anyway. But the reason I changed my mind is not because I know I couldn't make it, because I thought you could. Uh, it's because I didn't want to waste them. I gotta get some nano armor or something going, but right now I'm more concerned about doing stuff I haven't done in the last map. In the last map I had nano armor. So I'm not that interested in, in getting it that fast again. Oh, no, I don't need to mine it with that. That's it. We want more. This stuff is completely useless. As far as I know, all you can do with it is place it, and it acts like a torch, I think. Let me just grab one. And it probably doesn't even light up very well. I've also been grabbing wool because I need wool to create the uh, cable, the alloy cable for the blue electric stuff, the blue tricity. Take that iron. Iron is definitely not in short supply, <laughs> but it's always useful. So let's take some. I want to try this thing somewhere. How about here? Yeah, provides a ton of light. I only brought 14 potatoes. <laughs> I don't think I have enough 
to do this uh, elaborate mining expedition that I want to do. Let's grab that. Sounded pretty close. Oh my god! The iron. I mean, copper. Oh, I love copper. Copper's so good. That's it? More, please. Okay, no more. All this marble. Yikes! Damn guy. Trying to mess with me. Okay, let's put on my uh, my lap pack and charge up my rock cutter here. This is good. This is excellent. This is great stuff. I'm using this bronze pick that I found in a dungeon chest. It was like one of the first days I played. It wasn't exciting. It was just a regular zombie chest. I want to charge my rock cutter up, but I think I need to use it on something. More iron, this is beautiful. Man, going caving in FTB is the greatest thing in the world. Is this a ravine? It sure is. Ooh, some gold down the ouch guy. Oh, he decided to... Where are you at? I don't want to peek too far out because they can hit you. No, like if you can hit them, they can hit you. Yep. He's oh. Okay. Gotcha, sucker. Dang it. Oh, forget it. Forget the zombie. Oh, there's a lot of stuff over here. Let's just grab this good stuff. Tin. Let's grab. Wait, I thought I saw. Didn't I see something good? Maybe it was up here. Maybe not. Maybe that's, it. that's the only thing I saw. Anyway, um, I think I'm going to continue this for a little while. I might show you if I find something super interesting, like diamond. But other than that, it's going to be same old, same old. Just mining away. Mining my own business. <laughs> what a terrible joke. Uh, ooh, I think that is silver. Right? Yes. Yeah, it's lighter than, than tin. But it's very similar. This is lead. More tin. Yeah, so I'm going to do some of this. And I'll be right back with you guys once, um, I don't know, once something interesting happens. Or I have something interesting to show you. Ooh. That's going to charge now, right? Yeah, charged. You guys see that? The green bar is now full. Sweet. Yeah, I'll be right back. The episode is getting kind of long, so I should wrap it up really soon here um i do spot diamond though and i hope nobody need, needs this lava to power their geothermal whatever but better safe than sad that's on fire i'm running out of food some uranium some good stuff there's some diamond right there that's the main reason i came down here so let's grab that diamond and uh oh and some more redstone and call it a day. I've been grabbing the um, uh, the Nicolite. Well, I started grabbing it like this, and then I realized, wait a minute, I might be able to get more if I macerate it or something. So uh, I'm not sure if that's the case. I will find out though once I get back to base. Oh man, I want to get that diamond. Is there any more down here? This is a good spot. I like this spot. Look at all these ores, man. Caving in FTB is a may. Oh, you're on fire again. You gotta stop jumping into the, into the lava, little guy. Okay, let's grab some diamond. It's only one diamond. Uh, get out of my inventory. Really? Only the one? Dang. Okay, well, we do have that stuff. That stuff's good. Anyway, I'm gonna grab some more stuff, and then, um, I guess we'll check in on the quarry next episode. Uh, hopefully everything is going well. I think I might add some more chests just to be safe, because that's a huge area. Uh, and I don't know the next time I'll be on, so I'm going to add like a bunch more chests to be on the safe side. Make sure nothing gets uh, tossed out onto the floor and lags the server and even crashes the server. So yeah, as soon as I'm done this caving, I'll go back and do that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. 
of power management <laughs> or something like that. And I'll see you guys next time. Oh, there we go.